This is for you, Jack. I'll never let you go. Yo, welcome to another edition of Ryback Has Heat. I am the big guy Ryback, your motherfucking host. Today, guys, we're going, we're going all out today. I'm bringing the heat today. Today, we are doing Hellfire from the Hot Ones show, Hellfire Hot Sauce, Fiery Fool. The hottest sauce in the world without extract, 550,000 Scoville heat units. This stuff is badass, and um, this is definitely gonna make me. This is gonna. This is gonna bring the heat to me. I have a feeling. Um, this is uh, give you guys a little information on the peppers, and uh, to piss off the Jeffries and the the fucking Karens out there. The hottest sauce in the world without extract: Carolina Reaper, uh, Primo Seven Pot, Trinidad Scorpion. Uh, oh, what is this? Uh, ghost pepper. It says boot jalokia. Um, this sauce brings some serious heat and is not for the faint at heart, AKA little bitches. Great for cooking. goes on anything. Use caution and enjoy. Probably shouldn't eat it with my chase the heat from Johnny Scoville, mother of mother of pearl spoon. Don't taint your sauce, bro. The, uh, as Johnny likes to say, and uh, this is my official spoon that I do the heat things. And I got a lot of heat things, uh, which I got to post. Shit, I forgot to post an Instagram photo. I got to do that. Of uh, the hot ones have sent me uh, all their chocolate bars. And I think I'm going to start with the Mobe bar, the mother of all bars. And uh, I'm probably going to end up doing, start doing a couple heat videos a week. Everything going on with this whole CV deal, guys. Vegas, just all non-essential businesses got shut down. Gyms, restaurants, golf courses, anything essentially. Uh, all the casinos, all of them. Um, and I got friends here that work in the bar to bar uh, the night. What's it? The nighttime, the nightlife industry, and uh, bartenders and whatnot. They're filing unemployment like right away. So this uh, shit is very uh, real and. You know, we're going to provide entertainment on here. I've been very blessed in everything, luckily, so far. Feed me more nutrition, all the mail and everything's going to be staying open. All distribution centers, warehouses, are uh, file, those all fall, fall under essential um, businesses, so all those can remain open. So feed me more nutrition and all that will be available uh, unless things drastically change, which I don't see with what they're doing and cutting down on the spread of it. 30 days, and I think I think it's gonna. It's shown that it will. If everyone does their part, which will, they'll be forced to now, it will uh, get this under control. Let the temperature increase a little bit. We'll see what happens. Just got to remain positive. So, and uh, there's a lot going on though. A lot going on here, and I'm gonna get after it, guys. Take a little swig of my cold water. Get my little napkin. Paper towel, actually. Stupid! Woo! All right, you guys know the deal here. What I'm going to do is do a teaspoon here of this uh, Hellfire Fiery Full 550,000 Scoville heat units. And, uh, ah, shit, this stuff got a little. We'll see how the heat goes. We'll see how I handle it. Let me. Seems chunky. That's what she said. <laughs> guys didn't think I was gonna do it, did you? <laughs> Fucking gotcha. Little bitch Jeffrey. Come on. For the love of God. I don't want this to go all over the place. I just want you to go all over the fucking spoon and not come out in a huge clump. Da, da, da. 
Okay, it's a lot. It's falling. It's like a huge clump. Oh, am I going to regret this? Shh. Oh, I can't touch my face. I felt like Leonardo DiCaprio right there, right? I just did that. I felt like Leonardo DiCaprio and what's eating Gilbert Grape. Look it up. You'll know what the fuck I'm talking about. And if you don't, watch the movie on Netflix if it's available. Hell of a movie. Leo, early days. Two favorite Leonardo DiCaprio film uh, ever uh, films that he's ever done. What's Eating Gilbert Grape and fucking Titanic. This is for you, Jack. I'll never let you go. What time did I start? Oh. Whew. Still good. What was hard in there? Wow. I gotta say, it's like a hard, did they leave like a reaper piece in there? Ooh. Ooh. Well, herbs. <clears throat> Mouth is water. I, the taste of that's really good. At, actually, it's hot though. But it's not a. Uh... <sighs> so that. <sighs> Man. I, I can taste the Reaper peppers in it too. Reaper has a very um, distinguishable taste to me. I, oh. So you can see, actually, I'm not I'm probably a little light glisten. Yeah, there's a light, there's a little sweat there. Damn it, I got the spoon on my glistening towel. Oh. Almost two minutes in. So I'm going to say that this isn't, uh, this Scoville heat units wise is the highest sauce I've done on here, on here. But it doesn't taste like the hottest. That Mad Dog 357, which was 357,000 Scoville units, that was hot. That the bomb ground zero was hot. That had horrible taste. This has a nice, like this is a good flavor to it, actually. The Hellfire, and it does, it has no extract. I'm a fan of that. I wonder if those extracts kick your ass, man. I wonder how this, hold on one second. <laughs> Bought these from the store in case of an emergency with everything going on. I figured buy a bunch of hot chips. That way, if there's people here living with me in dire times, we're going to have a little sip of water now here. <coughs> that, uh, well, if I got really hot food, they won't touch it. They can have the other stuff. I'm going to do for you guys, I'm going to put some sauce on a, on a Pocky ghost pepper chip. Which these are hot in their own, right? If you watch my ASMR video on that. So what we're going to do is, no, we don't want to get the spoon. We're just going to go on the chip. We don't want to go too crazy. Come on, spread it all over. All right, we'll do it on a chip, we'll see. We'll, one, two, three, go. Mmm. That was good. Damn, that was good. 
Ooh, definitely some heat on that. You got to be careful with this sauce. Getting it all over the place, especially with little dogs around the house. Got to be a responsible doggy daddy, single doggy daddy for the ladies out there. Um, all right. I'm going to say, though, just having that second piece, a uh, little serving on the chip, nowhere near as hot as even just doing the spoonful, which is crazy. My heat tolerance has gone up nicely, but I do, it's, it's weird, different sauces, you can see the sweat coming now a little. That was really good though. If you guys haven't had those Pocky ghost pepper chips, they're a real treat. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I could feel that. But not, uh, not the worst that I've done. Flavor-wise, that's probably my favorite taste-wise so far. And all the sauces. Uh, on a heat scale, on level one to 10, I'm going to give that a five on that. Uh, going to give it a five. Flavor, I'm giving it, uh, for considering the amount of heat, I'm going to give it a, I'm going to give it an eight for flavor. That's a good, good sauce right there. I at least enjoyed it. Um, I could eat that and mix that in food and, and enjoy that. Um, whereas some of those other extracts and sauces guys are like, you can, you can usually use small amounts to like really kick up your food, but it doesn't really give it a good flavor or it doesn't benefit add the flavor, any flavor to the food. It just gives you pure heat where this gives you heat and flavor. So I'm a big fan of this. The fiery hellfire hot sauce, fiery fool from the hot ones. I got, um, I'm going to show you guys. Hold on one second. What I got. Oh, oh. I got to get a bigger box. That's what he said. Um, let me show you guys my little... So we got the hot ones. And a big shout out to them. Willie Pete's Chocolates. Um, hot ones on, on Instagram. The mother of all bars. One of, uh, Willie Pete's Chocolates.com uh, We got to do this one. This is a hot ass bar. I got um, Willie Pete's Chili Cherry Nightmare Bar. That will probably be, I would imagine, the second bar that I do. I got the Mad Dog Plutonium right here. Number nine, which that is the one I know a lot of people want me to jump and do. But this is, guys, you just don't jump <clears throat> and do the main event. You work your way up the ranks. And you guys see if any of these other up-and-comers can take the big guy out first. And then I got to work my way back up to that main event. I've done the hot bites. I've done these already. Check that out on the channel. Badass. I got, you guys are going to like some of this shit that I got. I got the Bean Boozled uh, Extremely Hot Fiery Five. I might do that with Taylor Spadaccino. Um, that or the Bean Boozled with her. We got two. We might be doing another video, hopefully. Um, I do have, I don't know if this was, I don't think this is a Willie Pete's bar. This is uh, the Lynn uh, Chili, Dark Chili Bar. Maybe I'll do this one first before the Moab, because I have a feeling the Moab has more peppers in it than this. I'll have to do a little research on that. I have the Hot uh, hot Ones, the Last Dab Triple X. Here, that one's going to be coming up on this on Ryback Has Heat. I also have Willie Pete's Nemesis Bar. There's over 30-something Reaper peppers in this bar, guys. 30 something reaper peppers. You've seen the videos where I've eaten like six, seven, or eight reapers. There's 30 something reapers in this world's hottest, delicious half pound dark chocolate bar. This one is a, this one met will screw you up. And then I got, this is a hot, this is going to be before the, this is going to be one of the sauces, the things before Mad Dog is Cajun Fiery Foods Get Bitten Black, Ma Black Mamba. Six hot sauce, six million Scoville heat units. Six million Scoville heat units. So I got my box of little things here, guys. I still got some dried. These were hot as shit, the 357 chocolate ghost pepper reapers. I'll do another something with one of these or a couple of those one of these days. I got this regular Carolina Reaper dried dehydrated peppers. Hot as fuck. So I got to actually get another box. I got some uh, extracts here as well. 
here. These I do these. I put these in water and just drink it for pure heat. This is an apple pie uh, moonshine. Uh, it's yellow brain strain mash, yellow reaper mash, yellow scorpion mash, and brain strain powder. And what you do is, and this is 2.0, I've done both. You put these tinctures in the water and you drink them. And they help raise your heat tolerance, which I'm actually going to probably do a little bit of one of those in a little bit, just since I did some heat tonight. And I try to do a little bit of heat every day as I get better at this. Because I, I enjoy doing this, challenging myself on it, because it's really mental. So, anyways, guys, uh... That was the one, Ryback right Cassie, Hellfire, Hot Sauce, Fiery Fool. And uh, you got to handle this Mad Dog Plutonium with care. Just touching the bottle will burn your hand. Uh, and then when I go take a piss, I will get a fire hose or burn my dealio. All right, guys, that's Ryback right Cassie. Thank you very much. Subscribe to my podcast, Conversation with the Big Guy Ryback, right on all podcast platforms. Also here on Ryback right TV and Feed Me More Nutrition on feedmemore.com and Amazon. <laughs> Thank you guys very much for watching. Get hungry, stay hungry. Feed me more. Thank you guys very much for watching Ryback TV. If you could smash that subscribe, hit that like button, share this channel. And for Feed Me More Nutrition on feedmemore.com, save 10% with Podcast 10. Click here for my podcast conversation with the big guy. Ryback available on all podcast platforms. Click here. And for more videos of yours truly on Ryback TV, click here. Feed me more.